how good of a trader can you become? Stay tuned, we'll talk about that next. G'day traders, I'm Stacy Burke from Stacy Burke Trading. Today we're gonna to be talking about how good can you get as a trader. Um, we <clears throat> talk about the seven step daily routine, we talk about creating a vision, we talk about accelerating your learning, goal setting, we talk about journaling every day, reviewing your trades, building a playbook, uh, doing all the things that the elite performers do, <clears throat> studying new trading strategies, thinking of new ideas, um, looking at managing your capital better or reducing risk on losers and maybe making more on your winners. So today we're going to talk about how good can you get. And we talk about all those things because trading mastery is a lifelong journey and I get a lot of people emailing me asking me to go over more specifically entry and exit strategies I've talked about moving the bulk of my trading to, to end of day and, and actually all and entirely to end of day and the reason why that is is uh, is a f for a few for specifically uh, lifestyle um, you know the idea is to be able to place orders and not be on the screen the bulk of my mistakes came from being on on the screen uh you know averaging into losing trades impulsive irrational trades emotional trades revenge trades get even trades trades that ultimately costed me money and, and blew up some small trading accounts um, the other side of the coin is that i i believe that the end of day trading for the the way that i trade offers significant um asymmetrical risk reward opportunities especially for retail traders the spreads become irrelevant largely um, and your risk is not too much dissimilar from an hourly trading system but the reward opportunities are you know four five ten times your risk so that was my you know these are some of my reasons but that's required me you know diligently studying day after day for years to um, refine that strategy and every single day I still work at it to try and get better at it to try and get better at executing uh, you know reading the market um, focusing on just a couple of simple trades rather than trying to trade all different trades on on different pairs I'm looking for one or two really good trades on a basket of, of currency pairs um, but again <clears throat> you know I've I've not missed a day in 10 years of looking at the, the charts and studying them and, and trying to learn from them. I've never missed a day. And my wife will attest to that. I spend, you know, whether it's a little bit of time or a lot of time um, back testing and strategy, strategizing and note taking and journaling. I'm constantly just trying to refine that edge because the, the odds are stacked against us as retail traders. Uh, and so in order to survive and, and not only survive and stay in the game, but you know, my goals, I think my goals are pretty substantial um, and I'm um, dedicated to fulfilling them. And even if I fail and I get halfway there, I'm going to be, I think, uh, in a good position. So what will it take? How good can we get? Well, <clears throat> that's up to you to decide what your goals are in terms of what you want to get out of trading um, and how you're trading and, and the style of trading that you're going to have. What is it going to require for you to put in? to get better at that, to, to maintain your edge, to be able to stay as an elite performer. Um, you know, for me, the first goal was to, to get there and be consistent. The second goal was to become better at it. And the third goal was to, um, you know, profit from it and master it. So figure out what your goals are, traders. Uh, <clears throat> work on them every single day. You know, build your vision, refine your strategy. You know, think of new ideas, test them. Focus on risk management, keep your trading very simple, keep getting better, and just stay focused on the big, the big picture. Uh, trading is only one of many things, but it can create a life for you and a lifestyle and offer you opportunities in your family and you know, significant others, whatever that is, <clears throat> to create a life perhaps uh, where you can give back and uh, create for others as well. So stay disciplined, keep getting better, you know, um, I always ask my kids this with sport, you know, are you, are you as good as, are you the best that you can be right now? If you really want to do something, and I know they're, they're committed to their sport, so I don't hesitate in asking them, you know, are you as good as you can get? And inevitably the answer is, of course not. So keep working at it, keep getting better, stay focused, and may the markets go with you.
Hi traders, it's Stacy Burke from Stacy Burke Trading. If you haven't done so, please head over to my website at stacyburktrading.com. I create updates on almost a daily basis and I would love for you to receive them. Just click on the blog. If you want to enter your name and your email address, I'll send you my free audio program, The 7 Step Daily Routine for High Performance Traders. This is essential knowledge for all traders in all markets. And this is for helping traders to master the market with discipline, confidence, and a winning mindset. I appreciate all your feedback and comments. As always, traders, stay disciplined and may the markets go with you.